Hey guys, Gameverse in here. Today I'm going to teach you how to fix stuttering and textures flickering and shadows flickering in the game Black Ops 3. And as you can see right there, there's some immense flickering going on and it's really annoying in the game. And I used to have this issue quite a lot and it was really annoying because I couldn't fix it. But now I'm going to be teaching you how to fix it. So first off, you're going to want to start the game, obviously. Once you have the game open, what you want to do is press start or escape to open up the menu, then go to graphics, then change your display mode from full screen to windowed full screen. And the shadows glitch is something to do with the crossfire or SLI. So if you turn it to not full screen, then it will disable that in the game. And as you can see, this shadow is not flickering anymore, which is good. So it stopped the shadows flickering. And also, as you can probably tell if you're watching the video, I'm getting a bit of stuttering in my game. So the, the easiest way to fix it that worked for me was to literally go back to options, graphics, and what I did was click sync every frame and made my max frames per second 59. And it might be hard to get it to exactly 59, but that's exactly what I did. Click F to apply and then go back into the game and your game shouldn't stutter at all which means that you can have a smooth gameplay even if you're getting a 60 F fps sometimes it stutters but it's not getting any stuttering right now so if you're still getting low fps right now you can go to graphics and then change your render resolution to 90 percent or if you want to put it lower you can always increase performance the lower you go and you want to press apply go back into the game and it might look a little bit more blurry but it's got way better performance and once you exit out full screen, it might have changed some of your settings here. So on here, another thing you want to change to increase FPS and reduce stuttering is change order independent transparency to none and volumetric lighting to none and also disable subsurface scattering. And once that's done, you'll get the best uh, FPS without stuttering. Thanks for watching this quick tutorial on how to increase your FPS and reduce stuttering in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So leave a like if this was helpful and also comment telling me if this works for you. Also share this with others that could find this helpful and don't forget to subscribe for more Call of Duty Black Ops 3 zombies coming up on my channel. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video. Goodbye.